In this tutorial I'm going to go over how to rotate a, a object with flow graph in CryEngine. So I'm just putting this over. So here's our flow graph diagram. So we've got uh, a box here and we want to rotate around the Z direction. So if we select it and right click create flow graph uh, and we're going to call this rotate uh, um, box. Uh, so at the moment we've got n uh, not a lot in here so we need to add a node so right click add node and we can go straight to movement and rotate entity so this is just a simple always uh, rotate entity so we can choose assign graph entity speed uh, this is uh, degrees per second so I want to rotate it around the Z axis so let's stay 90 degrees per second. Uh, so let's try that. If we go down to AI physics, we should be able to check that. So checking that button will now um, activate the flow graph. So you can see it's rotating, but it's rotating around the origin of the box, not the center. So I want to do one around the center. So to do that, let's just disable this one. So if we right click over in there, disable. Uh, come over to objects and then AI and then a tag point. So this is a just a non-drawn object so it won't appear in the game view uh, that we can tag things to. So I'm just going to come up here and set it to follow terrain and snap to objects. So that means it will snap to the ground or the object. So in this case uh, I want it um, in the center, so I'm come down into the center uh, and then just unselect everything. And then we need to link the, in this case, the box to the tag uh, point. So if we come up to here, link object, uh, come over to the point that says room, drag that down over to the tag point. So those are now linked. Just to, to check that, let's um, select the tag point and move them up. Uh, and you can see that uh, they are now linked. So we can uh, right click on the tag point. This is what we want to associate everything with um, because we know where the center of this is. Create flow graph. So we'll just create a new one. Rotate box two. Okay, so we can come over here, add node, movement, rotate entity, right click, uh, assign graph entity, speed, mm, let's go a bit faster, 720, we want a fast rotation, and come down to AI physics and test it. So you can see now we've got a, a much faster rotation, but it is now happening around the center. And you can also see the blue line linking the, where the box used to be, um, which is quite useful. So if we just uh, come down into the game space, we'll back up above. So now if we go into game mode, control G, we can see uh, the box uh, rotating. Okay.